Hi, my name is Stephen Van Orden. My name is Matt Harris. Hi, my name is Heather Osler. I am a teacher at Lake Mountain Middle School. And I am Chief Academic Officer of Compass Rose Public Schools, which is a public charter network here in South Central Texas. I teach kindergarten at Sigalili Elementary in Lehigh, Utah in the Alpine School District. I think as a teacher personally, that control is an illusion we've forced on our students or at least that we've set up a system so that students feel controlled. Well, a lot of times when we're teaching, it's, oh, you're learning this so you can use it someday. But I love the whole method of learn now, use now, because learning and education isn't preparation for life, it's life itself. I mean, there's so many kids working on different projects at the same time. Things can get really crazy. Blended learning is about trying to use technology in a way that allows students to get the most out of the experience that we have. With blended learning, it gave me a better opportunity for students to actually dive into poetry and to look at it because I could give an instruction at the beginning and then they could go to different stations and they could go watch some videos of poets. And by the end of class, submit one, two or three poems based off of what they learned throughout the day. I also found that by leveraging blended learning, I was able to ensure that all of my students had a voice and demonstrate their learning in the way that best fit their needs. Mathematics can be so much more visual and conceptual if a student can manipulate something on their screen and see it and engage in it and then also have a conversation about it. So my students can hear accents of different people from around the world and my students can see cultural events and festivals and foods and the internet is full of amazing things that they can use that we can expose them to right from our very own classroom. I think what I love most about blended learning is just the, the plethora of ways that you can support students wherever they are. In a modern classroom, the blending happens in the classroom. The students watch the instructional videos in the classroom with the teacher, which may seem a little strange at first, but this little change made such a massive difference in my teaching that I can't imagine ever going back. I love teaching for a lot of reasons, but one of the things that I really love is when students get excited about their learning, um, when they thank me at the end of the day and they tell me how much they enjoyed the lesson or they wear something that they've sewn, that's very rewarding. And then connected to that was those moments when it was almost this literal thing, you know, happened and they, they got it. And to be a part of that moment when they, they finally got it, a student was struggling, struggling, and then they finally learned something. And to see how happy and excited and proud of themselves, uh, to be able to be a part of that is really the biggest part of, of why I love being in education. Granted, this is not a perfect process. I have not figured it out, but I feel like blended learning has helped me dramatically by handing me a tool set to help me get closer to that than I was before. And I don't think I'd be able to do that without the tools of blended learning.